Hello, I am George. Welcome to George Tech Zone Health. Today we'll learn about Bluetooth. You've probably already used Bluetooth in one way or another. Share files from one phone to another, connect to a wireless item tracker, wireless keyboards, DWS, etc. Technically, Bluetooth is a wireless communication technology that enables short distance data transfer. In general, Bluetooth has a range of about 10 meters. Bluetooth uses ultra high frequency, UHF, radio waves between 2.402 and 2 GHz. 48 GHz. The latest iteration is now dubbed Bluetooth 5. This technology is very useful for a variety of applications ranging from game controllers to wireless TV remote controls and more. Why was it called Bluetooth? Well, it got its name from a historical figure who united all Danish tribes into one kingdom. His name was Harold Bluetooth. So before we get to Bluetooth 5.3, how do we get to Bluetooth 5? Look, Bluetooth 5 is the fifth major update to the Bluetooth standard, with several notable updates. In short, Bluetooth 5 offers 8x more data transfer and 4x more connectivity range compared to its predecessors, it was also 2x faster. Additionally, its 2 megabits per second bandwidth means it can support two sets of wireless devices simultaneously. This begs the question, is a Bluetooth 5.3 product significantly superior to Bluetooth 5? Version 5.3 of the Bluetooth Core specification, also known as Bluetooth 5.3, released earlier this year includes several new feature enhancements aimed at improving user experience and power efficiency with increased reliability. However, this is a minor update to the Bluetooth 5 standard. Now we will change our approach and explain the changes in more detail. Typically, Bluetooth devices send the same data multiple times to ensure it was received correct ERC. A low-power driver in the Advertising Data Information ADI, field identifies successfully received data packets or copies of identical packages. After that, the controller discards them instead of forwarding them to the hostly. With this new generation, sent data is checked only once and duplicate data is removed immediately. This is clearly much more efficient and saves energy for the device receiving the data. How does this woe? This different development characteristic of Bluetooth 5.3 become designed to reduce down at the again and forth communique among the receiver and transmitter. Normally Bluetooth protocols use encryption to guard records being transmitted. The degree of protection is in part depending on what number of characters a key has. This new characteristic lets in a bunch to specify the minimal key length for this reason decreasing the again and forth. This development may also upload to the performance with which Bluetooth controllers can talk the final results of key period negotiations to the host. Typically, Bluetooth devices have two duty cycles, a low duty cycle and a high duty cycle. For example, a person wearing Bluetooth headsets is on a low duty cycle to reduce power consumption until they receive a call or play music. The device then switches to a high power cycle. This new feature aims to improve the user experience by quickly switching between the two cycles. Basically, the faster a device can switch from low duty cycle to high duty cycle, the better. Is. User experience. This new feature in Bluetooth 5.3 allows connected devices to perform channel classification when data packets are sent over different frequencies. Previously, sorting the data was only possible via the central transmission facility. With this additional feature, packet collisions are minimized, thus improving performance. It also contributes to reliability by minimizing the susceptibility to glitches that can occur in the peripheral device. This is more likely when the central and peripheral devices are physically separate. 